Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. What a wonderful So today's video is going to be my June empties. I've got my basket right here. I did finish some things up while on vacation, which went into July 1st, but I'm still gonna consider it empties for June. So I have a ton of stuff to show you guys. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, most exciting first, I'm just gonna start with the body care. So the first thing I finished off is the Trader Joe's Brazil Nut Body Scrub. I love this stuff. It was so good. The scent is amazing. I believe I opened this up for my summer project use it up that started in June. So I went through this in a month, which just goes to show you how much I loved it. This scent was so good. It was definitely very coarse, but I still loved it so much and would totally pick a backup, pick up a backup to save for next summer. I also finished the Sol de Janeiro Coco Cabana Cream. This is just a little mini body cream. Finished this up on vacation. It was the perfect scent. Just a nice like warm vanilla coconut but this cream was like really it made my skin sticky um, even after it dried down and it didn't really feel moisturizing so i did not like the formula of this one but the scent was awesome this one i actually finished off like way at the beginning of june this is the vanilla mocha cream body cream from bath and body works love this scent just a wonderful like chocolatey coffee scent I adore this um, and I think I have a few backups in like a lotion and a shower gel that I'm saving for fall to use but one of my favorite scents of all time. If you guys watched my spring project use it up you saw this one already but this is Whip Vanilla Chiffon in the Fine Fragrance Mist. This is the second one that I've used up all year long, um, second mist that I've used up which if you know me you know that I don't use them very quickly so was really happy to finish this one off love 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 this scent it's just like a really nice simple almost fruity vanilla loved it so much and then I've got two hand soaps here this one is mahogany coconut I loved this scent it's creamy coconut mahogany woods and lavender um, I believe this one was in the kitchen and it was actually a really nice scent for the kitchen and then I also finished up the Gentle and Clean Warm Vanilla Sugar. I didn't really notice much of a difference in the formula for this one, but it's creamy vanilla and sparkling sugar crystals, just like a super simple vanilla scent. And then I was working on finishing up a few pocket bags that I had noticed were pretty much empty. So here is a strawberry pound cake, love this one, and then a toasted vanilla chai. This is one of my favorite scents of all time in pocket back form. And the last body care item is actually this little mini from Replica in Sailing Day. I finished this one off on vacation. It was the perfect summer vacation scent. I swear this scent was awesome. So I really enjoyed this. I, I don't know if I would get a full size, maybe next summer, um, just because this is really just a summer scent for me but it was so nice, you guys. I really liked it. So moving on to candles, I only finished off three, which for me, a typical month, I'll finish off like three to five candles. So this is on the lower side, but I'm still glad I finished them off. We have mahogany teak wood here. This one is just a classic. Absolutely adore it for the like office slash gaming room that Ryan and I share. I like to have something kind of unisex in there for him. So that was this one. And then also finished off a champagne toast. You can tell I was using like the white barn ones this month, um, but champagne toast is amazing. We use this one in the living room. It's great to get rid of any strong smells from like cooking or anything so love this one and the last candle is berry trifle from homeworks this has to be one of my favorite absolute favorite homeworks candles i've ever tried um it was so yummy for the summertime it was like the perfect gourmand where it wasn't too cloying and like cakey but it was just enough cakey with that like fresh refreshing berry in there i do have a review of this up on my channel i'll link it up above I loved it so much. This is wild blueberries, strawberries, blackberries, vanilla pound cake, and grand marinier sauce. Just amazing, just such a good scent. I actually burned it all the way down and I had to just stop burning it because it got so close to the bottom that I got scared, but it didn't extinguish itself or anything. So this one lasted a very long time. And I am seeing down here, I forgot a hand soap. This is blueberry Bellini. I believe this one was in Ryan's room. He loves the blueberry scents. It's wild blueberry, bright citrus, and sparkling Prosecco. Just like a nice, fresh blueberry scent. So I did finish off four wax bars from Scentsy. And I think in July, I'm gonna focus on finishing off most of my summer ones because I'm gonna start wanting to melt fall. So I'm so excited for that. But let's talk about the summer scents. I have cu ooh, cucumber lime, almost dropped it. 
loved this one. It was just a nice, fresh and fruity scent and it was like perfect for hot weather. Coconuts for coconuts. This one was awesome. I did this one both in the living room and the bedroom because I was so obsessed with it. It is such a wonderful like candied coconut. It was so good. Finished off Bonfire Beach. Now this one definitely reminds me of um, Marshmallow Fireside from Bath and Body Works, but like if it was summer, it still smells just like Marshmallow Fireside. Like they could be like brother and sister scents or something, but this was an amazing scent. I loved it so much, especially for the bedroom. And the last one I finished off is Clementine Cupcake. Um, this one wasn't very strong in my opinion, so it wasn't my favorite. Just like a fruity bakery scent, but it, it wasn't strong at all, so I did not like this one. We did finish off two wallflower refill bulbs, one in mahogany teakwood. This was in Ryan's bathroom. Just a really nice, simple scent. And this one, I'm not quite sure. It's something fruity for sure. It's either champagne toast or raspberries and whipped vanilla. I can't decide which one it is, but it's one of those two. And it was a nice, just like fruity scent. Okay, I've got a few skincare items and that is it. So I finished off this Creme Shop Pure Solution Soothing Moisturizer. This wasn't my favorite, but it was good. Like, I, I feel like I haven't found my go-to moisturizer just yet. Let me know if you guys have some suggestions. I have combination skin. It gets dry in the winter time and oily in the summer. Um, so that's my skin type, but I found like I have a great toner and I have a great skincare routine I just can't find a good moisturizer. So yeah, anyways um, I also finished off the Mary Kay clinical solutions vitamin C serum I adore this stuff and I'm out of it and I'm gonna be out of it for the next week until my mom can drop some off for me I'm so sad, <laughs> but I love this stuff And then the last thing I finished off for the entire month of June is this Jack Black Jack Black lip balm in natural mint. I didn't realize that these actually have an SPF, so that's pretty cool. But this is my favorite lip balm of all time. I bought like a six pack so I could keep it in every single purse that I own and every bag that I own. I have one of these. It is like my holy grail. And if I don't have it for a day, I get so mad. So Anyways, finished off this one. So that is it for my June empties. Well, thank you guys so, so much for watching that video. It was a little bit shorter than typically, but I feel like I finished off a ton of body care, which is not typical for me. So that was really nice. But anyways, that is everything for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.